Hello. Hello, YouTube, my friends. Um, this is Kaithman One Year, back with part five of my uh, tutorial on making a Blender Minecraft rig. And this, today's episode, I'm doing it um, on texturing. So today we have basically the guy, and he's still not textured yet. So that's what we're going to do. Texture is like basically the color that's showing up on the guy. So pretty much, first of all, what you want to do is go, I'm, I'm going to go on like, go onto your like search thing. I'm going to the skin decks on Firefox. And basically you look for a skin that you want to put texture your character with. That's what I used to do. Sometimes it doesn't work, but hopefully it will this time. Skin decks. All right. Skin decks. And now here, let's just... I don't know. Let's just do Steve. Let's go with Steve. Steve. Never mind, actually. Um, yeah, let's go with that guy, actually. He looks pretty cool. So, now what you want to do, click. You don't actually have to change your skin. And if you don't have a Minecraft account, then I will show you an alternate thing. But... And... Alright, so now don't actually change your skin. Just drag it down here. Onto the thing and it should show up somewhere so i'm going to quit that just a minute and here it is i'm gonna call it um tutorial um texture okay so now what we're gonna want to do in blender the rest is all blender so now that you have your skin uh you're going to click on only the mesh not the bones or anything and what you want to do is go over here to this little bar thing, and they'll, there will be, uh, where the hell is it? Sorry. Okay, so it'll be this, and go to, it'll be diffuse, turn down the intensity, so that it looks, I don't know, maybe intensity, yeah, around there. And now that we have this new material, keep the, we're going to go here. Over here, this like the little texture thing, and if you don't have this yet, just uh, click. It'll be new material over here. So now, type, go down here. Once uh, you got a new texture, type image or movie, and down here it's image sampling. I'm pretty sure. No, sorry. And mapping. Uh, image sampling. What? I'm having some troubles. Just a minute. Okay, generated. Change this uh the coordinates to UV. And just a minute. That is really weird. It's not supposed to do that. Okay, let's just hope this works. And if it doesn't, then oh well. Here we go. So now that you've uh, gone and opened the image. Basically, I'm gonna go to desktop because mine's on the desktop. And where is it? It's like, tutorial texture, open image. So now it is, wait, why is it blurry? I don't know why the hell it's blurry. Okay, so now that we have the tutorial texture, you go over here the with the plus thing, or actually don't. You want to create a new one by over here there's like a little thing here you want to get a new one shoot how do you do this okay yeah it's like that so basically just like drag a new one and over here this is actually going to be the one now uh here this is like what it is so we're going to go to uvi image editor and go into edit mode over here so now just press a to select everything maybe and go a minute tutorial texture so now it should show up, and if it doesn't, if it's like this, because mine isn't showing up, just go to Display, Textured Solid. So now it should be textured. Let's just render that out, just to be sure. Yep, it's textured. So that's work. that seems to be working all right. Um, 
Oops, I actually didn't mean to do that. Okay. Now that we've got this so far, you'll notice that it's blurry. So pretty much you'll go to File, User Preferences, and System, Mint Maps, Off. So now it's, see, it was like blurry before. I don't even know the point of those, but it just makes things blurry. So just turn it off. Please turn it off. Okay. Um. So now we're just going to exit that and now it's all it's it's beautiful now and even if we render that and i'm just going to change the camera view down here Beep. that looks that looks okay for now but just a minuto. Um, I'm going to go over here and see how it's like this. It's we do not want that. So it's well, let's turn on just ambient. Sorry, ambient include uh, occlusion, and we'll render that out again. So now it looks. I don't know why, but it looks a bit blurry. Um, but yes. So pretty much now that we have done this. We are going to see how it's like all messed up and stuff. Basically, first of all, what you're going to do is go to, I'm going to go to top view. I am still in orthographic view. And pretty much now I'm going to shift and right click on all the faces of the head. And since they're all squares, it'll work. So now over here, it's just this box thing. So press AA or to select everything. And pretty much just make it a square. So I'm going to go S and hold down this button. Um, okay, so I'm just going Shift S selected to pixels. If it's kind of like this or something, it'll go there. But we don't really want it to go there. So now that everything is in the square of destiny, we're going to turn... Okay. So now that we've pressed A to select everything that we've on the faces, and now since it's like that, we have to rotate it. So press R to rotate this, and then once it's like that, see how it's a bit lopsided? Just press Shift S and select it to pixels. And basically, that's pretty much all you need to know about that. I don't even know what the hell is that for. That's weird. I hope you didn't go bald or something. Um. So now this is the side of the head. Select pixels. I will rotate this, and nope, that is the wrong side of the head. Oops. So now I'm just going to grab this, and this is the right side of the head. No, so, so now, oops. Grab, selected the pixels, and now we'll go to the top of the head. Grab, shift S, selected the pixels. Grab, and is this the back of the head? Sorry, I really hope, okay, that, you're good, that's the back of the head, because that, if that was the front of the head, he'd have some serious troubles getting, like, a girlfriend there. Um, so, now we have his face looks beautiful now, and, Okay. Oh, I think, yeah, that's the bottom of the head. So now we're going to want to rotate that to the back. Okay, that's good. So now we'll render out, see if that his head looks good. Oh, and it's still blurry. That sucks. A lot. Okay. That is actually not supposed to be blurry, so. Um. I will see you guys in a minute once I've got this figured out. Um, Oh, sorry, guys. 
Hello again. I figured it out. Uh, before, we've had some troubles with this whole thing. And basically, you have to go back to this little box over here, click Image Sampling, and turn off Mipmap and Interpolation. The filter size, drag it down to 10. Sometimes it will be like something like that, filter, but turn it to box. Make sure it's a box. So now, when we render this, oh, shit, Sue. Uh, yes. Okay, so now his head looks... His head looks less messed up. So, okay. Now that we have that, we're going to just texture the rest of the body. So basically, to do this, pretty much... The problem with the guy all, like, clumped up in this is because you can't really texture his sides without going into wireframe. It's just pretty... Blah, it's hard and stuff. So what you're going to do is hold down control and just left click with your mouse and make that like a circle here and hold control again and drag this up do the same with the arms drag them to the side so that you can actually see the side of them don't worry it won't look messed up until later no sorry i'm, I'm just kidding it, it'll look it'll look better and now we've done that with that leg and done the same with this leg Okay, so, now, we have done this. Yeah, before I've had a lot of troubles with, um, this actually, if the texture does not show up, guys, um, basically, what you will want to do is, um, this, this will be afterwards, but pretty much, you kind of have to subdivide these, uh, faces, and just make new textures. So, I'm going to actually, like, here you could make it like that and then assign it but so now if you render that see that'll appear to be purple so yeah that's what you do you just basically texture the whole body like that which is really really stupidly annoying but yeah if it, it, if the other thing doesn't work then yeah that's what you got to do that i had to do that for most of my rigs but yeah, recently I figured out kind of a way to do that. So basically now I'm just scaling this down, grabbing it. Where the hell did his arms go? So now I'm just going to rotate this. R and... Oh, I'm pressing S for scale, but I'm holding down the scroll button thing. And... And shift S, selected the pixels. But notice it's like five pixels and it does not look good at all. So gonna grab that over there there selected pixels so now all of his arms are good but some of them are upside down so we still have to change that uh, yes sorry I'm just not sure sometimes you you're not oh okay sorry sorry this part of the arm goes over there and this part of the arm goes over there. Yeah, it's over there. Okay. And now this goes over there. So, basically, okay, I'll just do one more. And then that'll that's the basic idea of it. I'm just rotating it. This is the basic skill of texturing, except it is, it, you can, like, die of boredom. So, have a health potion on you something um boredness potion that would suck okay i'm still you might want to zoom in i'm just scrolling in oh this part is weird okay and that looks pretty good i'll just render this one more time make sure it's looking yeah it's looking okay and we're going to that is basically the idea of texturing and i will see you guys in the next episode and we will be doing face rigging. So notice how the face is kind of just does not look that good right now. We're going to give him a mouth. He does not need eyes because kind of he has like glasses. But yeah, that's all for now. Uh, we might make headphones on him, but that's the basics idea of texturing. I will see you in episode six. Yes, in episode six. Bye.